I really appreciate you joining me today. And this news comes from Hornchurch. And it involves a 73-year-old man called Raymond Nugent, who has been jailed for seven years for possession of 44 firearms, some of them he made himself from scratch. You may not have seen this story and you definitely won't see any headlines implying that he was involved in any gangs or was responsible for any of the firearms that got onto the street. In fact, they described him as a gun nut and somebody that just enjoyed making firearms at his home. But there is many risks associated to this, not only the fact that they could be stolen, but also the fact of ruling out completely that he ever sold any of them. The police said in a statement that he was arrested by the National Crime Agency after a tip-off and detectives discovered the workshop inside a building that he'd been making for many years. Nugent from Hornchurch was sentenced at Snaresbrook Crown Court on the 20th of January to seven and a half years in jail. He was found guilty for possession of 45 firearms. The NCA alerted the Metropolitan Police after it was revealed that Nugent had imported a blank firing weapon from the Czech Republic. They dated this back to 2018 and a warrant was executed at his home and officers discovered a number of safes that was inside that had firearms and ammunition that was wrapped and stored. He was taken to be interviewed at a local police station and the police searched the address and the initial inspection was apparent to police that he was in possession of viable firearms. Several of the firearms he had built himself using drills and vices to create fully capable weapons and an expert pointed out that his guns were 25% more powerful than any factory produced weapon of a similar calibre. There was also deactivated weapons in the stash and some of these included an Italian Bruni, a Model ME 38 calibre revolver and a Turkish Attack 95 semi-automatic. He was bailed and was charged via postal requisition in October 2019. The police said that there was no evidence to suggest that he'd been selling the firearms to anybody else. It was thanks to the tip-off from the NCA we were able to find these guns and take them off the street. But I really want to hear what people have to say on this story and if you think the story's fair and what you think of the sentence.